Get ready for a slugfest in the 2A Division I state championship. These are the picks. Welcome into the picks presented by All Star Inflatables, your guide to the Texas high school football state championship games. My name is Greg Tepper of Dave Campbell's Texas Football and TexasFootball.com. Thank you so much for tuning in. Today, we're previewing the 2A Division I state title game. 7 o'clock Wednesday night at AT&T Stadium in Arlington, it's the Class 2A Division I state championship game between the Hawley Bearcats and the Shiner Comanches. What are the keys to this matchup? Key number one, the Bearcats offensive spark. We need to have a conversation about this Hawley offense, which has definitely taken a back seat to its defense in the postseason. They're averaging just 19 points per game in their last three. Now, look, they've won all of those, and they shouldn't apologize for that, but they're going to need more from their offense with quarterback Rody Hooper. One of the reasons that their offense, I think, has scuffled is that they lost their star running back, Austin Crumpton. They've had to move Deontay Ramon from wide receiver over to running back. That shifting has made things a little bit more fits and starts for this Bearcats attack. They're facing down a ferocious defense from Shiner led by Tyler Bishop. They're going to need to play their best game yet. So can the Hawley offense find that spark or will the Shiner defense feast? Key number two, strength on strength. So this is going to be one of the most physical games in the state championships this year, and it's especially going to become evident whenever Shiner has the ball. They've got that big offensive line, and of course you remember the Brooks brothers, running back Dalton Brooks and his brother, big old Doug Brooks, who gave that stiff arm from hell last year that went viral all over the internet. They are back, and they are as physical as ever. They line up in the split back veer, and they run it at you. They make no bones about what their offense is about. Meanwhile, the Hawley defense makes no bones about what they are about. They have one of the best defensive front sevens pound for pound in the state hard stop. Led by Kyle Nichols, they absolutely dominated last week against a very good Marlin team. That is going to be where this game is won and lost. Hawley is going to need to have an outstanding game up front, and Shiner is in for a big old test against his Hawley defensive front. So, when strength meets strength, what happens? And key number three, Wednesday Night Lights. This game's happening on Wednesday. Yeah! It's kind of weird, right? Uh, that is certainly something that both these teams are going to have to adjust to. Playing on a strange schedule in a shortened week, both these teams played on Thursday night to prepare for this Wednesday night affair. And that's not even to mention all the other things that come along with playing in any state championship game. The fact this game is televised nationally on Bally Sports Southwest. The fact that there's at AT&T Stadium. The fact that a state championship is on the line. There's a lot of other factors that go on in this game besides what happens in the 48 minutes on the field. Who handles those external factors better? Who am I picking? I'm going with Shiner. The Comanches get my pick here thanks in large part to the running game with Doug Brooks and Dalton Brooks and especially on the defense, which has been so good all year long. And I think that defensive front is going to be able to make a few plays. I have some questions about this Hawley offense, especially because they've had to move a few things around. They're going to need to have a big game from their quarterback, Rody Hooper, and I think that what they need to do is find a way to make a couple of big defensive plays. They've had a knack for that. The Hawley defense is by far the strength of this team, but in the end, I think Shiner's a little bit too much. I think the Comanches go back to back. I think they win the 2A Division I state championship. And those are the picks. What am I wrong about? Leave comments down below. Don't forget that subscribe button. Follow us on Twitter at DTTF. Like us on Facebook. Facebook.com slash Dave Campbells. Follow us on Instagram. Instagram.com slash Dave Campbells. And of course, see us at TexasFootball.com where you can find complete coverage of the 2021 Texas High School Football State Championship Games at TexasFootball.com slash state. Thanks for watching. Enjoy the 2A Division I state title game. We'll see you.